when I removing the saddle post, I noticed that it had been damaged due to a non-smooth surface that holds it. I carefully filed from inside to remove the sharp edges. Next, I'm attaching the motor cable. This particular controller should be rainproof. And yet I'm still going to modify even more, adding some inner tube to the cables. Adding more hot glue to the screw holes and screws to ensure that even more waterproof. The rear shifter and the tailor are in place. I still need that instead of shifter cable. I put oil into the cable. Perhaps the even better way to install the shifter cable so the gear shifting will be smoother later. mirror on the left side. To do this I need to move other things on the handle of my room for the mirror holder. The most important thing is a bike uh, luggage rack. Adding a traditional rack is not easy and I have to mo heavily modify. So I decided in favor of a rack that is attached to the side of the seat post. It has a load capacity up to 10 kilos, but I'm sure I can increase by adding a vertical support. The rack tube is thicker than that was in my previous bike so I have to replace mounting adapters on my touring packs. I try to visually get a clue how it will look with my touring packs. Mm -hmm. 